Right, I had a um, walk up to this waterfall up in the mountains here. Um, as you can see, she's bone dry. I was hoping there'd be water up here. I've got an army one litre water bottle, but if that runs out before I find water, then I'll be in a bit of strife. So, um, you'll see, we had rain about three weeks ago, so hopefully there's some little puddle somewhere. And if there is, um, we might better strain some of that um, to get fresh water. So, what we're gonna do is we're gonna keep climbing and see if I can get past where this starts. There might be spring or a waterfall somewhere or a little hole that I can get any bit of water whatsoever. As you can see, she's gonna get ran out of water shortly. Almost out of water, um, and I've got to get up there to try and find some water feeder on fire because these rocks are very hot and sharp. It's all right on flat rocks, but on this stuff here, it's it's like walking on glass. Some of these are really sharp, so a bit slow. Definitely need water though, otherwise I'm going to be struggling to get back back down to my bike. Alright, so just go to the sun a little bit because it's friggin' hot. Bad news is, that's the last of my water. Good news is, found water. Bad news is, it's this stuff here, which is probably gonna make you sick. So, gonna use a um, filtration method um, using charcoal and sand to try and filter a mouthful. I'm gonna have a sip of this, I'll show you how to do it. Right, I found my ingredients an old burnt out log here. I'm gonna use that ash, the sand around here to make just put that there, stay there. All right, oh. that's gonna fall over. I'm going to use my shirt, get some sand, on the bottom, charcoal, charcoal helps get all uh, chemicals and bacteria and things out of the water so it's a natural um, uh, like a natural filter and the sand will stop whatever finer bits of stuff get through we've done that you can use a bit of grass on top to stop the bigger stuff but I'm not con too concerned about that there's actually that that's a bit of kangaroo poo can't use that in your drink Make sure there's no kangaroo poo on there. Otherwise, it defeats the purpose. All right, let's get some water. All right. All right, I've got my little bundle. Hopefully you can hear this. I'm gonna pour it. Made a little hole in the top there. If you can see that, like a little bum hole. What I'm gonna do is get some of this water and pour it in there. And hopefully it comes out reasonably clean. That's like dirty. I don't know if you can see that. You don't want to overflow it too much. Slowly let it soak up. I don't know if you guys can see how clear this water is, but it's like, it looks like petrol, nice and dirty. That's what we're trying to filter out. I don't know if you can see it very clear. It looks black. It looks worse. 
in real life. All right, let's get some more. I can feel it heavy, it soaks through. We don't want to flood it through, you want it to slowly sip through. Otherwise, if you just pour it, it'll come out the edges and then it defeats the purpose of having the, the filter. So you want it to slowly filter through. Slowly come through the bottom. That tastes horrible. Tastes like vomit. With a bit of a smoky vomit taste. But I guess it's better than nothing. All right. That should be enough to get me going, at least to the next bit. I guarantee there has to be water further up if there's water here. Hopefully, otherwise we can always come back here and drink. Thank you. Let's carry on. Right, I found water, which is good. It's reasonably see-through, I don't know if you can see that. And I reckon it should be tasty. Better than what we had earlier. It's actually tasty, it tastes like rocks. Now, you can't beat this. Further up you go, the better the water source. And I found where this source comes from. Just to take that off. Oh, that's cold water. I'm gonna try and fill up my water bottle like hand with this. It's gonna take a while. It's like someone peeing into a bottle pee faster than this, but I'm thirsty. Need all the water I can get for the way down. How good is that? That would just have to do. Alright, time to go for a swim. I'm going to place this there. No matter how many times or how far up you get, it still feels like there could be crocodiles or... It's very unlikely because we're so high up in the mountains, but it could be a long necked monster or something. Back out. 